Hi, my name's Paul Taylor. I'm here in England for the Beef Eater Mix London competition. And today we're at the distillery to find out a bit more about how gin is actually made. So let's go. <laughs> so just um, show you that bit of the time. That really knocks out Let's get I missed the beginning part of the story, but these paintings are something interesting over here. Some story about some, some woman. I missed all of that, but it's good. Take a photo of this the, behind the bar. I'm, I'm going to take a photo in a second behind the bar here. I don't know what I'm doing. Somebody show me how. What's the good technique? Hold that. Make sure that's against you. Otherwise, against me. Okay. Otherwise, it'll explode over your guests. Oh, okay. Cool. You do that. So it explodes yeah, over you instead exactly. of yeah. Okay. Nice. There we go. It's the proper technique. <laughs> uh, now we're currently looking at the uh, the prohibition when it was illegal to drink uh, alcohol in the US but we were still great. Just waiting for the, uh, the tour to start again. <laughs> Sitting here with little cushions. It's like being back at school, it's fun. <laughs> it's gonna smell of alcohol. No phones, no lighters. Just like a petrol station. <laughs> Smell it from here. Hopefully, we get drunk off the fumes at 9 a.m. That's some really interesting stuff about uh, juniper berries. Uh, I had no idea that they came from Italy and Macedonia and places like that, and it's old school. You've got to beat the bush, literally beat around the bush to get the juniper berries out. So, that's basically a big version of what we saw earlier on, the little one in the showroom where the girl was giving us a tour. That's a massive version. I like how everyone ignored it. It's like, yeah, don't use your phones, and everyone's got their phones out. It's great. <laughs> Anyone brave enough to tell me what it smells like? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Take a I hope there's somewhere to clean our hands afterwards. It's Distiller. It's been an incredible day. I've learned tons about gin and I'm so excited. So thanks for watching. Hope to see you again soon and I'm going to get another gin and tonic.